In this video, we're going to cover a lot of information on the Ceramonic Blink Me, a brand new wireless microphone designed for vloggers, YouTubers, content creators. And from every perspective, perhaps it is one of its kind. And the audio you are hearing at this moment comes from the Ceramonic Blink Me, the transmitter. The transmitter designed with a round shape, just exactly like a smartwatch with a multi touch screen with colorful pixels and a lot more intuitive designs. I'm actually recording with this uh, Blink Me transmitter at this moment. And on top of my Sony ZV-1, the case exactly uh, that uh, the Ceremony Blink Me receiver. And later in this video, we're going to talk a lot about this product and why it's so special for my content creation. Now let's get started. And I'm going to divide this video into different sections from the basic unboxings, the hands-on, the audio, scenario test, and audio quality evaluation, and my wrap-up summary about this product. I mean, I'm going to give you uh, what I love about the ceremony with me and also what I hate about this product. I mean, first, here's a brief conclusion. The Ceramonic Blink Me B2, actually two transmitter, one receiver, is a magnet integral design with great audio performance and 24-bit depth internal recording, multi-touch gesture screens, uh, round shape, beautiful ergonomic design. And it's definitely first of its kind, especially uh, how it could be adaptive to your scenarios that seamlessly merge to your uh, workflow. And considering both the receiver and transmitter are equipped with a uh, colorful touch screen, now you gain more access, you gain more precise control only with the wireless microphone itself. And needless to say, the Ceremonic Blink Me also come with a Ceremonic app. It's a, a second product right after Blink 900 that be fully compatible with the Ceremonic Blink with the Ceremonic app. That this app not only could fine tune the parameters of its product, but it could also be doubled as a, a high performance recorder, uh, audio recorder, and a video recorder camera as well. So that is to say, this Ceremonic Blink Me is actually a very ambitious product. They try to step up into a deeper world of the vloggers, content creators, and they try to give the users a complete solution from the hardware, the audio, and the video creation workflow as well. And you should also notice that considering it designed with magnets all around the accessories and the product, it might come across with some issues with my Sony cameras, and I will also show you later on. So now let's start with unboxing. Okay, first let's take a look at the package, the Ceramonic Blink Me B2. The two transmitter, one receiver, a magnetic integrated design, the 2.4 gigahertz wireless smart microphone with touch screen. So this is a very innovative design, at first of its kind. And the package design is also colorful, beautiful, and designed for vloggers. On the back of this package, you can see the package list, the personalized themes that you can change the wallpapers on this round touch screens and this is a simple intuitive touch screen which I will show you later on in this section and also have a companion ceremonial app and help you to customize the settings and change the personalized themes and also with a built-in one touch one button noise cancellation and noise reduction mode and also designed with some convenient magnetic attachment just like the base the magnets the magnets coach mount the clip and the clamp. And they also support up to 22 hours onboard recording at maximum 24 bit depth sample rate. And here, this is what we're gonna get inside the package a hard paper box, the ceramic design, nicely built, very beautiful. And inside the package, this is finally this ceramic Blink B2. But apart from this hard case, uh, you also get this, a user menu, uh, some papers, and even more. Next one, let's take a look at what's inside the package. 
the ceramic hard case that inside this hard case you get uh, a built-in handle a zipper that is uh, dustproof so water resistant uh, this package that's a, a built-in handle uh, designed with a zipper shockproof water resistant designed with reliability in the mind I'm gonna get inside the package take a look this is a blink the ceramic blink b2 exactly you have to Apple Watch, right, left and right. Designed with poco pins and magnets. And also, uh, this is one uh, is a, a MVC. It's a, a phone clamp system designed with a, a cord mouse mouthpad at the bottom. It's expand to fit nicely with your phones and designed with a coach mount on the top. This design was designed by Ceramonic. This one is nice. The Ceramonic Blink Me B2. Two transmitters, one, two transmitter, one receiver, designed with inbuilt lithium battery, charging, data transfer, and designed with a, a touch screen, which I will show you later on. It's easy to snap and go. But on the upper part of this card case, let's get a convenient magnets, magnets clip. Take a look. These two design, magnets, anti-twist rubber, ceramic logo. Well, they take out one of the receiver, clips together, and you can clamp on your shirts. Design with a coach mount. It is a conventional coach mount with dots that can clamp very reliable on your clothes. Well, this one is uh, magnets. Coach mount as well as a quarter mount spread in the bottom, uh, in the middle, align with the poco pin and mount just like that. You can transfer this cubic box into the receiver and you can convert it in either side that you can flip the screens exactly wh whatever you want. The magnet coach mount and four individual magnets pins. Magnets pins. The design was the, this magnet made because that you can casticate one of them together. That take a look. If this is one of your clothes, you can tap on your clothes and just snap this wireless transmitter on every part of your clothes without have to worry about falling off this magnets. And the magnets feels very strong, so just be careful when you are handling. It's magnets accessories. When you finish your shooting, uh, you can align these accessories just like that. This, this comes with two cables in a package. One of them, this one is a, you know, this one, um, it's A to C charging cable. And this one is an audio transfer cable, the TRRS to TRRS. Once you connect with the ceramic receiver into this slot, well, it will automatically detect your device. It converts this TRS to TRS or the TRS. This smart, unique design. Well, it's a package you have even more. Take a look. You also have separate phone films. I mean, phone films to protect your screen on your receiver, transmitter, receiver. Well, this wind muff. Also designed with a bayonet connector on the back. Take a look. Designed with a bayonet connector that you can easily snap on top of the microphones. Coming next, I will show you how to get your hands on the uh, transmitter receiver, uh, all these nicely designed ports, and the screen as well. Well, this is going to get the Blink Me B2, the two transmitters. The kit takes them out from the Magnets, the poco pins, and automatically power on. On the receiver, it is this design with a touch screen. This is exactly a touch screen. Uh, it has some similar uh, design philosophy with DJI Mic, but uh, it designed with way better functions. The channel one, channel two, and left and right, left and right. Take a look. 
this is a right channel, this is a left channel. And if you, you can see the remain battery life, remain battery life for each one of channel, and you are now recording in mono mode, and with some uh, gain adjustment. I mean for the receiver gain, uh, plus three, and uh, the channel two is always uh, plus eight decibels. Scroll down, you can see recording mode, you can change to mono, recording mode to mono, stereo, or safety channels. Mono, that can blend the two channels into a one single channel that makes the audio together. When it's recording stereo mode, uh, you are actually record a separate channel left and right. The channel when you record the two transmitter audio into separate ch audio channels uh, for better post-productions. Uh, this is ideal setting for uh, some two persons interview. And if you record in safety channel, it also design a uh, record in mono, but with two different gain that help you protect overexposed audio. Uh, normally speaking, for my YouTube channel, YouTube content creation, I choose mono. Next one, you can adjust the RX gain. I mean, this is a receiver. I can change the receiver gain. I have set gain control to plus three decibels, but you can change all the way from uh, a minus 12 all the way up to uh, plus 12. You also change the displays. You, you also enter in power saving, always on. I normally choose always on for better experience. But we went, when you want to get the maximum recording uh, time, maximum battery life, uh, just tap on power on. The power saving, the screen can auto shut down, auto power off after a little while. Take, I will share, take the always on. Some settings, tap, you can reconnect with the two transmitters in case you want. And you can change the brightness of this screen. And I'll also change the language into uh, English, Chinese, or take, take a look. Support different languages. It, do, it built with nicely experience all around the world. And it also reset to factory default. And this is the version, this is serial number. And this is a firmware numbers. I mean, this wireless microphone can be firmware upgrade every time you have a new functions. This is the certification info, the FCC, some other stuff, IC, and yes, take just for your reference. This is gonna get on the touch screen, the small touch screen, but design was multifunctional. And once you place one of the receiver into the slot, uh, it will automatically detect and display only this single channel on the screen for your better experience. And you can see the real-time the volume metric audio meters units on the side to indication that whether it got overexposed or unexposed. Well, on the side, you can see this is a, a power on button. If you long press, you can power on. And if it plus tap this button, I mean, you can change. You can directly change the gain uh, with three decibels step. It's very convenient as well. It's a Type C port to charge. There's a lithium battery inside the case, and it's also be doubled as a digital audio interface that you can use the Type C port to transfer audio to your phone or to a laptop. So you can connect your uh, monitor or uh, earphone headphones uh, to monitor the, the real time volume the audio from the receiver. And on the back of this side, you see some of the uh, specification and some certification info. This is gonna get nicely built, nicely done. On the other side, let's take a look at this, uh, the wireless transmitter. The wireless transmitter, the blink -me T, the blink -me TX, designed with four pogo pins on the back, the wireless pairing, uh, charging, uh, data transfer with its, its dots. Designed with a round shape screen that just exactly like you have a, a smartwatch. The ceremonic, this, 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 this can be customized. The channel to remain battery life, the signal strength, the real time volume gain, and it's now unlock. Scroll down, you can see this is a power on mode, always on and you can turn off the screen after a little while. And this is settings. You can pair the change language 
change the date and time. Uh, you can reset version certification info exactly like you have on the small touch screen on the receiver, but this one has a, a way better experience. And this one you can tap to mute this channel or unmute. And this one if you tap, you can use this uh, receiver as a uh, in, uh, as an internal recording, just turn on recurrent recording. Uh, you can, you even have different bit depth options. Turn it off. And if you scroll from if you scroll from bottom to top, you have this all the settings onboard recording. Uh, I mean, you can change with a rec, rec protection. You can turn on or turn it off, and some auto recording. Every time you turn it on, uh, it will automatically record this audio inside this internal memory. It's exactly like you have on a Rode Wireless Go 2. I can change the bit depth to 60-bit or 24-bit depth. I always use 24 for maximum dynamic range. And you also get to noise cancellation. They can change the original sound or with uh, high-definition noise reduction uh, just exactly inside this uh, transmitter. You also have this uh, TX gain that you can change on the uh, receiver and transmitter as well. The brightness, you can change the brightness of this screen that to save your more batteries. So these are some of the unique features inside this touch screens. A joint touch screen for wireless microphones, the third of its kind. And you can even customize the background theme, the wallpapers with the companion app, which I will show you later on. I mean, when you tap this noise cancellation, tap the once again. If you tap, you are now in the noise cancellation mode. Take a look. It's NR icon and identification. And if you long press this NR button, you can mute the channel. You can mute the channel or unmute the channel. And every one of the button can be customized within your companion app. Also designed with some uh, noisy curvature around the shape. It's not a perfect circular screen, but the protection glass has some very unique design in the detail. And it's really thin, really lightweight, and really small. It's also multifunctional. Uh, I mean, this is first of kinds. I've never seen such beautiful uh, wireless microphone system. It's so compact, beautiful design, multifunctional, with the giant screens, customized accessories, and so on. So coming next, I will try to show you even more about uh, the excitement when you create content with this ceramic Blink Me. It's, it's not a magnet, it's a bayonet connector. Nicely built. So this is going to get inside the package, and these are some unique design for this product. Coming next, let's take a look at this uh, interface and how to get your hands on the uh, transmitter, receiver, internal recording, etc, uh, etc. Et Another bonus feature for the Ceramic Blink Me is that if you take out this transmitter and long press on home screen, you're able to change the background theme. But first, you can see the QR code. You can scroll from top to bottom, bottom to top. You can switch back in between a different the wallpaper or aka the themes. Altogether, you have nine different choices on the basis of this a single transmitter, but you can also customize via the ceremonic. Uh, the app is a very powerful uh, integration uh, solution for your content creation, not audio, but video as well, which I will demonstrate to you. Now let's test out the ceremonic Blink Me together with the ceremonic app. Uh, I will share with you my screen capture on my iPhone, and you can do the same on Android devices as well. At first, I will share with you my screen capture. The first time you uh, enter this app, you have to uh, register an account with your mobile phone or your email. I have already done this device, so you can see in the app, we have different choices. Uh, for example, you have home, there's some microphone news. Uh, considering I have already connected with my Blink Me, so it will automatically reconnect with the device. But if this is the first time you uh, if it is the first time you enter this device, uh, let me show you how to uh, how to do this. Tap on the icon, disconnect. 
Okay, this, this is the first time you enter this app. Just uh, first tap the plus icon, search the Bluetooth. Because inside the receiver, there's a built-in Bluetooth chip. Yes, here you can see this is a Blink Me unconnected tab. We automatically reconnect with the Blink Me, and you can now view the device. But before you read the device, you must register account with your mobile phone or your your, your email. Okay, wait for the initialization and uh, connect it inside the app. You get the access to the receiver and the two transmitter as well. This is the, the size. You can see the signal strength, of the TX1 and TX2. You see the remain, uh, the remain battery life, and you can change. I mean, you can change the uh, the account because here I'm wearing this uh, the the transmitter number one. So I can change. If I tap apply, take a look. If I tap apply, it will automatically change the same. Uh, for example, I like this one. Tap. Did you see that? It can, I can change the same in real time. For example, I prefer the this Earth view. Yes, I definitely like this. But you can also customize. You can customize the slides. You you can actually customize the, the slides. Uh, you can select one of the picture from your album, so you can set your your portrait or your product showcase. You can customize the wallpaper. You can customize the slides. Select the two to five images. It's content of slide according to the individual taste. So this screen can even dub be double as your slides. These are some really powerful features for the wireless microsystems. And there's something you can only get on the Ceremonic app. And this thing's got the same on the transmitter too. Well, they can also customize the definitions of the buttons. For example, now you get to see the receiver. You can change the press, double press, and long press. You can customize all these buttons. Press twice. Uh, this is a screen lock unlock. And if you press the, the plus and minus icon, you can change this uh, output mode, or uh, you can even customize some other settings. But at this moment, it's quite limited options. But I believe in the future firmware upgrade, you must have more features to unlock with the new software. And um, yes, you can long press, long press. Yes, so this is something you can customize. And for the transmitter, you also have the access to press, press twice, or long press. Take a look. This is really interesting. Click on this reset to factory default button to go back to your default. There's something, and uh, you can see the blink mean detail, the device name, the firmware version, and the serial numbers. Yes, you can definitely, uh, you can definitely customize this, this this device name, and you need to restart after the effect. For example, this is blink me. I need to change to Syrah Wireless. Click on save. So next time we, I will get this device name on uh, this settings. And I also get to see this is a Sarah TX1. And this one, Sarah TX2. I get all the settings. I can easily recognize my device uh, under this Bluetooth device list. This is something you get on the device menu as well. And if you go back to the home screen, you can see uh, you can even see the, sub, the latest update about the brand Ceremonic. But this is not the case for the app. The Ceremonic app is actually a, a complete solution to be doubled as your uh, your audio recorder or uh, your uh, even video recorder. Take a look. This one you can use uh, Ceremonic as your uh, as your, uh, I mean, you can use this as your your recorder.
but you need to uh, apply a lightning cable to the type c cable to cable connect with your ceremonic and later in this section you can select set the sample rate the local filter the bit depth you can even record 32 bit card uh, bit depth input channel you can mono dual mono or auto and you can use noise reduction and vocal enhance you have three different options for the vocal enhance this is something you only have on the phone and you also have audio input source considering now they only have uh, this iPhone so you just cannot connect with you, know, you need a cable you need a ceremony cable a lightning cable to TRS or lightning cable to the uh, USB-C to use the digital output device just on this port there's some accessories you have to purchase by yourself and you can even record in, the, in WAV format MP3 or AAC the Apple format so this is really powerful and you can even add some mark when you record this audio and you can even use your iPhone uh, a microphone as a recorder sound source this is a real-time volumeter and some indication for uh, audio overexpose so this is a definitely a very powerful audio recorder on your palm size this is an audio recorder and you can even use that as a, a video recorder as well take a look this is something it's really powerful you can select flashlight you can see the flashlight uh, add grid time and change the ratio add timer or record in up to 4k resolution use a main camera on the left side you can see the, the volumeter and the tab you can change the focus or the exposure as you can see you can change the exposure take a look change the focus and you can even add some filters in real time or add some uh, spill effects auto take a look I want to optimize my face brilliant lightning smooth and you also get to change the audio settings the sample rate low cut input source input channel noise reduction vocal enhance exactly like you have on the audio recorder you can add yeah, 10 parameters ceremonic take a look you you have see this this is even be doubled as a, a teleprompter the really power although I, I don't i don't never use teleprompter but i think i believe this feature must be very powerful for some uh, content creators yes teleprompters can delete and change this 4k resolution you can browse all the files you can record inside the app and in this one you can see your device something have been regist registered authorized by ceremonic and your favorite um, and some help and feedback i mean the home screen you can see some other devices take a look you can see the blink me trx rx and the txr as well as the microphones and you can even download you can download the user menu online for preview this is something that is really powerful so just just give a try on this powerful device you must be pretty amazed by the, the software feature this definitely make the ceremonic blink me a truly wonderful wireless microphone system on the market in the year 2023 okay next up i will show you something that is really impressive for the ceremonic blink me as well here just here's a trick I uh, just want to show you the digital audio input interface via this Type-C port on the side. You can see on the side of the Blink Me, you can output your audio via this TRS socket or this USB-C port. But remember, if you want to use the receiver as a, a digital audio device, you have to detach all of the, all of the transmitters. 
that it can prevent you from accidentally power off one of the receiver or transmitter. Turn up the power off. Okay. Now I am done with a single. I am done with a, a single transmitter on the side of my shirt, and this now this blink me the receiver could now be doubled as your a digital audio interface. Just use a C to C cable or the 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 C to C cable, the very short C to C cable. And I will demonstrate to you the the blink me the two persons smart wireless microphone with touch screen, customizable transmitters and recording this official web page that beautiful design by ceremonic this is the this is a screen capture screen share there's something that i would share with you uh, in my tutorials on photography okay this is a page about this product it's an um, uh, overview uh, design with versatile transmitters and customizable touch screen interface and remarkably flexible ingenious touch screen with dual receivers simultaneously output 3.5 USB-C audio output for cameras, mobile, and much more. Here you can see it also features stereo Type-C digital audio allowed to connect to the Type-C smartphones, tablets, computers, and more. And pair it with Apple USB to Lightning adapter for compatibility with iPhone on the iPad. And the best part is that you can record from the uh, 3.5 FTC power, you can output two audio files simultaneously. This is a pretty impressive. I mean, this is a pretty impressive. I've never seen such great design in the wireless micro systems. And you also have an app for advanced control customization I've ever shown you in the previous part. Well, in this uh, official web page you get unlock more feature about this product and here's some spec i mean the you can system resolution the 24 bit tabs at, at maximum 48 kilohertz and you have frequency response maximum sound pressure level 110 decibels the sensitivity minus 39 and it's you can see the the, the transmitter building with eight gigabyte internal memory and uh, the bones equipped with uh, a lithium battery it's a lithium battery for the i mean for the transmitter you have uh, 495 milliamps and for receiver the capacity is 1600 milliamps so you can charge to the two transmitters that to gain a battery life for 24 hours it's a pretty impressive and for the transmitter uh, without recording eight hours with recording six hours pretty impressive yeah this is our spec sheet for this product as well uh, i believe that some of the features you might have not noticed unless you watch this spec sheet really carefully and with your mind especially the simultaneously 3.5 type c audio outputs for cameras, mobile, and much more with, at the same time with a headphone out. This is pretty impressive. Okay, then this section just want to show you uh, the USB-C audio performance for this wireless microphone system for your reference and also share with you more info about this amazing product as well. Okay, here's a basic test on the noise reduction on the transmitter receiver itself. Uh, actually, the ambient sound, you might hear a little bit about the background noise. The air conditioners, the fans, the wind noise, and uh, people walking all around. Uh, this is audio without noise reduction. And by tap this yellow button, by tap this button, you can switch back in between the noise reduction and without noise reduction. So tap and now the audio you are hearing at this moment are the ceremonic audio quality with noise reduction the process in real time directly in the transmitter itself so you can give the person your personal evaluation so this is before this is before and this is audio after noise reduction this is before noise reduction 
this is after noise reduction for your personal evaluation on this function. Okay, I think time to wrap up. Uh, I mean, the Ceremonic Blink Me is a very impressive wireless microphone system for my content creations. At this moment, I'm pretty impressed by some of the design in the detail. First, I mean, first, this product designed with three colorful touch screen for you to gain access to uh, to control the, all the settings without the app and on the go, very intuitive. And second, this ceremony blink, blink me, the receiver itself support the type C audio output and the analog TRS or TRS output. And second, on the receiver itself, it comes with a type C port as well as an analog TRS socket that to transfer audio uh, in, in digital or analog. I mean, for the type C port, this will make this product adaptive to your uh, laptop, your Android devices, and with some conversion cable, it is even adaptive to your iPhone, iOS devices as well. And for the analog output socket, uh, with the TRS to TRRS this cable, the ceremonic blink me could automatically detect the audio audio jack and uh, it's smart adapt to your devices that will they can only carry a single cable that is uh, adaptive to all of your uh, devices including your, your cameras your phone with a microphone jack and your laptop with uh, audio input output as well and third i mean the the magnus accessory design is a a whole ecosystem for the Blink Me. With the magnets, not only you can clamp, I mean you can use the magnets to whatever you want. And four, that this receiver could double as a, I mean, a double as a charger, a remote charger, to boost the battery performance for the dual transmitter as well. Last but not least, the price is very reasonable. I mean, this ceremonic Blink Me. It looks like it is a, it is a concentration on this uh, great design from the road wires go to the DJI mic uh, and some other excellent product in the market. They jam all the features together and they add some exciting new feature like the, the screen, I mean the operating system, uh, internal recording, the magnets accessory ecosystem, and they deliver this complete solution at a very reasonable price. This definitely makes the Blink Me a pretty impressive 2.4 gigahertz wireless microphone system solution in the year 2023. So this is what I love about this product. But there's still something to be better designed in the future. For example, the magnets. The magnets will cause some interference with your cameras because for Sony cameras, it's designed with a magnets switch button inside the circuit board. So once you mount, the ceremony ecosystem, the magnets accessory near the camera. Sometimes the camera will accidentally trigger the power on uh, without your permission. So this is something that needs to be further uh, optimized in the future. And uh, yes, the magnet design is also, uh, sh you should also make your personal precautions on the magnets accessory if you uh, suffer from some heart attack issues. So definitely bear this in mind. For the rest of design, I would definitely give a, a sum up for this product. So that is all about my basic impression, hands-on, and some personal tips and tricks on the Ceremonic Blink Me, the B2, with the two transmitters. And if you found this video helpful, please don't forget to sum up, subscribe, and hit notification bell. So in my future YouTube videos, you might come across with uh, this tiny little toys and we we'll definitely see you in my next video. Bye.